Welcome back to Mura. A few months ago I arrived just here to the finish of Vosaloped and now I'm back here in summertime. We are here at the World Loped Annual General Meeting. Vosaloped has invited us to Mura for the Annual General Meeting 2022. Behind me you already see the Italian delegations making their selfies. Follow me on this special edition of Gunnar's Nordic Adventures where we check out the annual general meeting of World Loppet. Come on! Where are you going? <laughs> I think I had the video. <laughs> this year the annual general meeting of World Loppet is taking place in Humura, the venue of Vasaloped. Of course, we are here this year because Vasaloped is celebrating its 100th anniversary. So, a great place to be for the annual general meeting. We are staying here in this uh, Mura Parken. It's a partner of Vasaloped, and the Vasaloped tracks are crossing this um, camping place and hotel. And now we're going into the main building of Mura Parken where the delegations of the World Loppet Nations are meeting at the moment for the, first, for the first meeting session. So follow me, let's check it out what they are talking about and how this is looking like. The public have been patient. And, uh, okay, now it's time for me to get nervous a little bit because after the coffee break it's my turn to have the presentation. So wish me good luck that I still have a job next year. This stage is yours. Okay, that's great. Um, just for you to know, this uh, presentation is taped by video, so please make sure to give big cheers and yeah, that's great, Gunnar, and so on, for, just for the video. Okay, I'm going to give you a small overview of what happened uh, past season um, in our communication channels. I think this was nice for the big cheer for the video. <laughs> As evening activity, the Mura Biathlon Club has invited us for some shooting here in the Biathlon Arena of Mura. Let's see if we hit the target. And here is a, a lock so you will not have snow in there and also in front. <laughs> Can you see? Yeah. yeah. Have you been doing a dry fire? No. Okay, let's do this. Because your target is empty. <laughs> Was it okay? It was great. Oh, perfect. Was it? it was not your first time. <laughs> Ready? Go! Go! Sandra from Canada, Gatino Lopet. She is here for the first time at the AGM. How do you feel at the AGM? Uh, it was an amazing, amazing experience. Uh, lots of nice uh, people, lots of countries, beautiful students. It was amazing. And this is Angelo Corradini. This was his 41st AGM here. 
Next afternoon activity is canoeing, some team building. Let's see if we're still a team after this activity. Okay. How is your chair? Everything fine of me. Okay. We're on the boat. I need a paddle. Paddle is here. First up the river, then it's easier to come back later. So unfortunately we only have one paddle in here. <laughs> Our Polish and Italian friends, they still have some problems with steering. <laughs> oh yeah, so we made it to the first island. It seems like the World Lobbit office is really a good team. App and me were working together quite well. As you can see behind me, that's the Italians and Polish team. They have some troubles, but also getting better and better. Okay, Juha, now after two years of virtual AGMs, how does it feel to have a real AGM again and meet all the people again? Oh, it's a relief. And, uh, we have been family four years and now just contacting with screens, it's, it's awful. And uh, I'm, so, I'm so happy now and enjoy this meeting with all, all members. And now it's a special year for Vasalopit, our host, the 100th anniversary. Um, maybe you have some words about the Vasalopet. Yes, of course, because uh, Vasalopet is the oldest, longest and um, biggest race of us. Very important part of, of uh, World Lopet. So I fully congratulate Vasalopet on my heart and on behalf of all the other members. This is Tommy from Vasalopet, our host. 100 years of Vasalopet, quite a long time. Yeah, it's a long Now, time. Uh, the AGM, of course, is also because of that year. Um, are there more um, activities this uh, year for the 100th anniversary, or have you celebrated enough? No, no, we will celebrate the whole year. We will now, in August, have our summer activities, which is uh, bicycle, uh, mountain bike uh, races uh, with uh, hopefully more than 20,000 participants. And then we have uh, two days of running. We have Ultra 90, we have uh, Ultra 45, Trail 30. We have a relay with 10 legs. So uh, we will celebrate also in August. Enough to, enough to do still. Now, uh, Vasalopet is definitely the biggest race. What is the role of World Lopet for Vasalopet? What does World Lopet mean for Vasalopet? Uh, World Lopet is important. We are a part of that and it's, uh, we work together. We try to uh, help each other with promoting the cross-country skiing worldwide and to have more skiers from outside Sweden coming to Vasaloppet. And that we have a good help from the Vasaloppet organization and the races which is in the Vasaloppet. 2022 is closed now.